Well, it seems that there's a lot going down with the ACC <clears throat> that I've been observing these past couple days. And uh, looks like there's some kind of magnificent seven freaking schools that are looking to get together and look at the grand rights, see how foolproof it is, I think the words were. And they had their lawyers to get together and look at this thing and determine determine how to freaking get out of it because the ACC is a single ship. And what does this mean? I don't know. I'm not a conference realignment type guy. Honestly, hate everything that has happened so far. Hated Texas and Oklahoma to the SEC. Hated USC and UCLA to the Big Ten. It's destroying everything that we've known from college football. It's destroying the Power Five. Um, and it's looking like it's moving towards a Power Two. Big 12 has been trying to hang it in there and getting teams, but none of the teams that they've got are relevant on a national level. And they're, I mean, it's noble that they're hanging on. They're doing the best they can with, you know, what they have. But the Big 12 is is somewhere in between. Um, and the Pac-12 and ACC are falling apart. And, you know, the ACC is eating itself alive from within. <clears throat> Led, of course, by Clemson and FSU looking to try to get out. Now it looks like they've got um, all these other teams. I think it was Virginia Tech. Uh, Virginia, North Carolina, and uh, some other teams, NC State. And now it looks like um, uh, Louisville has joined it. So <clears throat> I just saw the headline on Twitter. I don't know what it makes of it, what to make of that. Um, but, uh, you know, most of the teams are looking to get out. And, of course, my Yellow Jackets, Georgia Tech, uh, are, are sitting on their hands as they usually do. You know, when Britt Key was uh, introduced as head coach, we had the president of the school and we had the athletic director up there. And one of our guys asked a question. They said, "What? Where, do, where does Georgia Tech fall in conference realignment? And, of course, we freaking uh, talk about how we're riding with the ACC for some unknown freaking reason. Okay. <sighs> My school... Georgia Tech makes absolutely nothing but bad decisions when it comes to conference realignment. Uh, you know, never should have left the SEC back in the 60s or whatever it was. And uh, and now we are riding, we are going down with the ship and the ACC, and it's, and it's, it's not good. It's not good, and I, I mean, I'm really worried about my yellow jackets. Where could they end up if the ACC does fall apart, which looks like it's headed towards... It's looking like our two options are the Big Ten or the Big 12. And honestly, I mean, I guess both of them would be better than the ACC. Um, but, you know, I would hope that Georgia Tech would go to the Big Ten. Makes me sick to my stomach thinking about us playing Midwest teams. But in this situation, ideally, a bunch of other, you know, ACC teams go to, like North Carolina or Virginia or something, somebody we could play. Miami or somebody that we could play on a yearly basis or a few people that we could play that uh, that that would create some semblance of what we had before and some rivalries that we had before. That would be nice. Uh, if we went to the Big 12, well, uh, the Big 12 is not relevant, is not going to be relevant nationally. I mean, I just don't see it. There, there's not, uh, there's not any like, powerhouse teams there I, I don't see that can consistently do it it's going to be a power two very soon it's going to be big 10 and sec i hope that georgia tech can get in the big 10 not just for that reason obviously i want georgia tech to compete on a national level but the big 10 and sec make more money and obviously the dream scenario would be to get back into the sec but that's not happening uh that's not happening um but you know that would be the best as far as regional rivalries go you know, we've had a ton of regional rivalries like Auburn and Georgia, obviously. We used to play Tennessee. We had we used to play Florida. And uh, we used to play all these teams down in the south uh, at CC. And they were – they used to be rivals of Georgia Tech. And now, uh, I don't know. Our dream scenario is to get into the Big Ten. Hopefully a couple ACC teams go in there and we can play some regional games. But I don't know. This is a complete nightmare. Uh, Georgia Tech is, you know, 
in trouble and as far as conference realignment and I, I don't think I have faith in the administration to do what needs to be done for the better of the school. Hopefully they go after Big Ten uh, for the academics because that seems to be the only thing that, you know, they care about. And, you know, the Big Ten would put us in the best position for as far as money goes. We'd be able to invest more into the football program. You see that with some of the Big Tens. They just got this, you know, new deal restructured with their TV deal. All the schools are getting more money, and you see those schools putting it then into their football program because, after all, that is what is bringing in the money in the first place is the football. So, you know, hopefully we see that with Georgia Tech. If we go to the Big 12, that's just another – it's just a, a move, uh, just such a a, a, settle, a move that feels like we'd be settling for the Big 12. We'd be settling for less money, settling for mediocrity in football. That's just not what I want to see. So looking like there's going to be three conferences coming up. Uh, we've known the ACC has been a sinking ship for a while now. And it looks like it's coming to a head here. Uh, who knows what the season will look like coming up, but I don't know. I don't know. I just hope my Jackets can get in a decent conference and or get in one of the two conferences that's going to be football. I don't know. This isn't football. This isn't college football. There's no regionality. It's just money, and it's tearing the sport apart, and I hate to see it. And there's no solution for it. So just have to... Just have to freaking ride along and hope for the best. So, anyway, go Jackets, and I'll see you guys next time.